computational chemistry has really revolutionised the practice of chemistry. Chemistry was traditionally the province of experiment, but now the computer is providing a, an alternative way to do chemistry, and the two work very well hand in hand. So by combining computational work and experimental work, one ends up with a powerful combination that produces a better outcome. There's been big advances in computer hardware that's made computational chemistry really blossom. In addition, there's been changes in the software and that has made feasible things that one could only have dreamt of when I started in this game. The computer enables us to calculate properties of molecules, what molecules look like, how they react with one another. Originally, one would only be looking at models of real systems. Now one can look at the real systems and also one can get the, calcul the results much more accurately. One can make accurate predictions that sometimes will challenge experiment if they don't agree with experiment. Part of our work is to uh, design better antioxidants. So this is antioxidants that are more effective in scavenging nasty things that occur in the body. Some of these are so-called free radicals. Uh, we've done calculations that try and make better antioxidants than the carnosine, and we're going to test out whether, in fact, our predictions are true. We've found that using uh, facilities like uh, Orange at Intersect or Ragen at NCI have been incredibly useful for our research. It's enabled us to focus on our research and let experts handle the hardware part of the operation. Mm -hmm.